I wonder if these guys actually hacked Roblox. Not hacked Roblox, but literally the only thing that's broken is these guys' studio. I can see that. Hey guys, and welcome back to a brand new Roblox video. Hope you guys are doing absolutely fantastic, ready for another action pack video. I gotta ask you guys something today if you guys have ever seen something before, but you guys know that when I play this game, usually I just hop on the main page is what we're looking at right now. You guys can see that the popular games, there's Jailbreak, Zombie Attack, Phantom Forces, and then there's Top Earning, Top Rated, Featured, and Popular Near You. So there's a bunch of different tabs and stuff where they recommend games. Now, the Top Rated, normally it's for the OG games. It's for the games with the most amount of likes to the least amount of dislikes. Uh, good example, Bloxburg. Bloxburg, I'll check right now, has, we will see, uh, 118 million visits. So I'm checking down the page right now, and uh, I can see that, you know, there's 27,000 people people playing jailbreak there's 8,000 people playing Bloxburg and then all of a sudden there's two games down here it's called Fight Club and NXB there's one person playing Fight Club and there's zero people playing NXB now why are these in the list here now I'll, I'll right click and I'll go into this one I'm not even allowed to play these games it says the permission or the permission levels on this place prevent you from entering now it's absolutely insane I've never seen these before it says join uh, a group to add to your favorites and you will know when it releases so it is a new game that's going to be released although it's in the top I mean what is it is the rec top rated that's what it is it's in the top rated uh, spot or first and second uh, but there's nobody playing and it doesn't let you play them so Roblox isn't letting you play these two top rated games now I think I know I think it's just a glitch in their system and I may have actually know the changes that they made to it I think they're taking into account just the like to dislike ratio so if we go on Bloxburg right now you can see that there's 307 or sorry 327,000 likes with 10,000 dislikes I'll do the math for you all right so the like to dislike ratio on this game Bloxburg is three percent it's three percent uh dislikes to likes so you guys can see that there's obviously 97 percent likes with three percent dislikes and i believe that's why it's in the third spot we can check the next game over so that one is 3.1 percent you can see that this one only has 370 likes but there's only four dislikes and you look at this and it's one percent so we went from three percent dislikes to one percent dislike and I'm pretty sure this next game is going to be less than 1% dislike, and that's why it's top rated. Right now, they're not taking into account if you can even play the game, how many people are playing the game, how many visits it's got, when it's updated. None of that stuff matters, I believe. Well, at least for these two games right now, and maybe for the other ones too, because look at there's Apocalypse Rising 2, which I haven't seen in like months. Nobody plays AR anymore. There's Jim Island and Dragon Ball Infinity and a bunch of games that I've never really seen before. Hexaria. I haven't played that game in so long. There's only 30 people playing, but it has a good like to dislike ratio. I'll do the last one here. We'll bust out the old calculator. This is why I go to school, ladies and gentlemen. This is why I go to college to go four divided by 338. And our dislike rate. Wait, what is? Wait a second. All right, it actually might be a little bit glitched because it doesn't actually work out in that order. Uh, this one here has a better like ratio than this one, so I don't know why this one was rated number one. Maybe it's literally because there's one person playing, and that's what's kind of tipping it over. But I just think it's super weird. Roblox feels like it's broken right now. First, the other day it was the jailbreak uh glitch. I couldn't get in vehicles, I couldn't open doors, nobody could do anything in the jailbreak public servers, and they stole my money by the way, but we got her back, don't you worry. Also, Fight Club, what's going on with these two games? Why are they promoting these games that you can't even play? More than Bloxburg and Car Crushers and Snow Shoveling Simulator and all that stuff. And I really don't understand it at all. Wait, so this is uh, Kari Bros B Studio. I forget exactly what that means, but I'm pretty sure these are the same guys that made, was it Apocalypse? No, it wasn't Apocalypse Rising. I forget what it was, but I'm pretty sure these guys actually made another game fairly close to um, Apocalypse Rising. I forget exactly what it was. We did play it a few times. It was literally, uh, I think I made the video uh, PUBG in Roblox. And I again, I forget what it is, but it was pretty cool. Look at this again. Top rated Star Wars Legacy. Can I even play this one? I can't even play this. The BB, wait, hold. No, so it's only the people 
from this studio, uh, the BB Studio. I wonder if these guys actually hacked Roblox. Not hacked Roblox, but literally the only thing that's broken is these guys' studio. I can see that that game right there, Star Wars Legacy. Obviously, the first two, and there was a few other ones in the list that are made by these guys, that are made by this one studio that are breaking the game pages right now. I don't understand it at all. I am so confused. Oh my lord. Let me guys, uh, let me know in the comment section down, but what do you guys think? Did these guys, is it a Roblox glitch? Do these guys kind of hack Roblox a little bit? Uh, if I seem like I'm tired, I am really tired. I just got back from a really long class and it's so cold that it's cold and snowing and it's gonna be it. But thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy. I know it's a bit of a shorter episode. I just wanted to ask you guys your opinion on these games right now and why the heck are they in the top rated spot? Because obviously they're not, well, I mean, they are the top rated if you're only looking to like to dislike ratio. But other than that, I don't think it should be in the top rated video. And it's only, look at B&B Studio. B&B Studio. Uh, obviously, none of the actual popular games are B&B Studio. Actually, we might be able to see what else they've put out here. Games, they've got Star Wars Legacy, Injustice, uh, O-A-N-X-B, Cardi Bros Battlegrounds. This is the one I was telling you about right here. Um, they made this, and it was like Apocalypse Rising. We played it once or twice. Let's see if I can scroll it here. That's the screenshot that you guys remember. I think I even used this one as my thumbnail, or fairly close. That's gonna be it. Let me know in the comment section down below what do you guys think, and, uh, what's your opinion on this? Should Roblox really be fixing all this stuff? I think they definitely should. Subscribe to the channel if you guys haven't already. It's the easiest way to keep up in contact with what I'm uploading. Double episodes coming at you guys every single day. So definitely be sure to be excited for those. 10 and 12 PST, which is 1 and 3 Eastern. Uh, so thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Never fade away.